All right, how's it going? Well, to family, once again here at Rosendo Rodriguez with another great video here at South Coast Welding Academy in Houston, Texas. Now, for today's video, I'm going to give you some tips and tricks on how to run a 6010 route on a half inch plate. So let's get to it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so before we get started on this great video, I have a very special announcement to make. Our online WellTube store is now live. So go check us out at welllife.com to purchase our WellTube products. If you guys want a 5% discount on your products, go ahead and use my code, FlyDuck16. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we're gonna be doing 3D open root stick on plate. Now we're only gonna do 6010 root, that's it. We're gonna be using a 1 8 stick rod. We're gonna be welding on a half inch plate. 3G, that means vertical or uphill. First thing first, we always gotta prep our plate. That means clean it. Number two, we're gonna put a good 332 landing. Number three, a 332 gap. Number four, two tacks, one on each corner. All right, so whenever we start doing our route, we're gonna use 6010-18, and we're gonna be going at 70 amps plus or minus. So we're going uphill when we start doing our route. All we're gonna do is the stitch method. All right, so all we're doing is going up, down, stitch up, down. You're stitching right in between the gap, down up down but whenever you come down you got to touch your puddle so you're going to stitch forward right in the middle of your gap come down and touch touch your puddle all right go up stitch you're stitching up come down touch your puddle stitch touch your puddle stitch touch, uh, touch your puddle all the way through so you're stitching forward you're ripping through both walls and you're touching your puddle. What you don't want to do, you don't want to pull out. So when you're stitching forward, touch your puddle, do not pull out. You got to keep your stick rod inside your gap. Stitch forward, touch your puddle. Stitch forward, touch your puddle. Every time I'm stitching forward, I'm not pulling out with my stick rod. I stitch forward, I push, and I come back down, touch my puddle. You gotta make sure you touch your puddle. Every time I come down, I touch my puddle. All right, I'm about to finish this. I'll restart, warm up your metal, and then push whenever you get on the very edge of your keyhole. Rip through those walls. Make sure you don't pull out. Come back and touch your puddle. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so there you have it. I just showed you how to do a 6010 root pass going uphill on a plate. All right, so hopefully you guys liked it. Don't forget that our store is now live, so go check us out at wetlife.com. Get yourself one of these hoods, all right? They're very awesome, check them out. So, also, don't forget to use my discount code, FlyDuck16. All right, ladies and gentlemen, see y'all next time.